Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I'll guide you through all the steps you need to activate your Windows operating system. We'll cover different methods, including using a product key, activating with a digital license, and what to do if you run into any issues along the way. So if you're ready to unlock the full potential of Windows, let's get started. Before we begin, let's check the current activation status of your Windows. Knowing this will help us decide the right activation method to use. Go to your settings. Click on Update and Security. Then Activation. Here, you'll see your activation status. If it says Windows is not activated, we'll need to activate it. Otherwise, if you're already activated, this page will confirm that with a message like Windows is activated with a digital license. Before we get started, let's understand what a retail license is. A retail license is a license key you purchase, usually through Microsoft or an authorized seller. If you've bought a physical or digital copy of Windows, this is likely the type of license you have. Unlike OEM keys, retail keys can be reused if you decide to change your computer hardware. Let's start with the most common method, using a product key. If you don't already have a retail license key, you can purchase one from the Microsoft Store or another authorized retailer. You'll receive a 25-character product key that looks something like this. Make sure to store this key safely, as it's essential for activating Windows. Once you have your license key, go to your Windows settings. Click on Update and Security. And then select Activation from the left-hand menu. In the Activation window, you'll see a section that says Change Product Key. Click on it, and a new window will pop up. Here, carefully enter your 25-character product key. Double-check each section, as even one incorrect character will prevent Windows from activating. After you've entered the key, click Next. Windows will begin verifying your product key. This might take a moment, so just be patient while Windows checks the key with Microsoft servers. If everything is correct, you should see a message confirming that Windows is activated. Congratulations, you now have a fully activated copy of Windows. If you get an error, don't panic. Sometimes it's due to a network issue, so try again later. For errors like, this key is already in use, contact Microsoft support for assistance. To double check your activation status, go back to the activation page in settings. You'll see the message Windows is activated with a digital license or Windows is activated using your product key. This confirms that your copy of Windows is now fully activated and you're ready to use all features without any limitations. That's it. You've successfully activated your Windows using a product key. Once activated, here are a few tips. Avoid hardware changes as they can sometimes invalidate your license. Also, Always back up your license key and avoid sharing it, as each key is meant for a single user. Next, let's talk about activating Windows with a digital license. A digital license is a fast and easy way to activate Windows without needing a physical product key. When you buy a digital license, it links directly to your Microsoft account, allowing easy reactivation if you switch devices in the future. First, Open your preferred web browser and go to Microsoft.com. Once you're on the Microsoft homepage, in the search bar, type Windows 10 or Windows 11, depending on the version you want, and press Enter. On the results page, choose the edition of Windows you need, for example, Windows 10 Home, Windows 10 Pro, Windows 11 Home, or Windows 11 Pro. Click on the version you want to view its details. Once on the Windows product page, click Add to Cart. If you haven't signed into your Microsoft account yet, it'll prompt you to sign in now. Using your Microsoft account will help link the digital license to your account for easy activation and future reactivation. Follow the on-screen steps to complete the checkout. Once the purchase is complete, you'll receive a confirmation email 
and your Microsoft account will now be linked with a digital license for Windows. Now that we've purchased the digital license, let's activate it on your PC. To activate Windows with your new digital license, select the Start button, then select Settings. Under System, select Activation. Your activation status will be listed next to Activation. If you're signed into your Microsoft account, Windows should recognize the digital license automatically and activate. If you don't see Windows activated right away, try the Troubleshoot option. The Troubleshooter will check your system for issues and attempt to activate your Windows license. Once activation is complete, you should see Windows is activated with a digital license linked to your Microsoft account in the Activation section. This means your Windows is now fully licensed and ready to go. And that's it. Those are all the ways you can activate Windows. Whether you're using a product key, digital license, or reactivating after a hardware change, I hope this guide helped clear things up. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tutorials like this. Also, let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and I'll do my best to help you out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.